I know you had a mixed drink before, but have you had a cocktail? Talk about that. Welcome to these cocktails. And today, we're doing Edison's Medicine. We're going to get started with six leaves of basil. A half ounce of agave. You want to pour the stickiest item first and then use the rest of the spirits to wash it out. As long as you're going to use this side. Unless you have one of the other jiggers and then it's all the same. Three quarter ounces of fresh lime juice. A half ounce of yellow chartreuse. Yellow chartreuse is a herbal liqueur. A lot of sugar in it made by the monks. And if you guys haven't heard already, if you didn't already know, it's hard enough to get as is, but the monks aren't going to increase production to meet its new popularity. It's already been very popular and it was already very hard to find, but they're basically saying that they're not going to increase production because they're still focused on, you know, their day-to-day -day life like and stuff like that so it is what it is fellas and ladies it is what it is people one and a half ounces of cachaca we're gonna add ice give it a nice shake one in the ten one over top I didn't say this, but the leaves are very soft, so ice is going to break it up. So no need to muddle. Nice hard shake. We're going to serve this in a chilled coop. Chilled coop. Hawthorne strainer. Fine mesh. The strainer is going to catch most of the basil, but not all of it. It'll be little fine pieces that actually do make it through the strainer. Now we're going to garnish this with one basil leaf. Try and get this to sit right on top. It'll sink over time, but as it is, it looks great. There you have it, Edison's Medicine. Cheers. It's a very delicious cocktail. It's definitely cachaca forward. So if you're a big fan of cachaca, this is definitely one that you do need to try. You get those herbs from that basil, as well as those herbs and those spices from the yellow chartreuse. And it's not too overpowering because you have the lemon and the agave to balance it out. I promise you, this is a go-to cocktail for anyone who wants something where you know you're drinking an adult beverage, but it's not too strong. You guys are going to enjoy this one. Cheers.